mentioned before, I was kind of looking for something that I could get in on. And, um, you know, like many others, I saw the, the coverage of them winning the award and I saw the video of them showing the product off and I thought it was super fascinating. I mean, not just the idea of, you know, creating a silk road, so to speak, but just the idea that this was actually something beyond a wallet. You know, up until that time, most of the things that people were doing with Bitcoin were just wallets. It wasn't any kind of like real dApps, so to speak. It didn't hadn't even been kind of in coined the phrase. And so, um, you know, then then they then I found out they released the GitHub. Uh, they they released the source code for that hackathon project on GitHub and said, you know, here it is. And so I started like submitting some pull requests to their code and, and, and then I emailed Amir directly because I didn't get any response from them on GitHub. And I was like, hey, I'm really serious about contributing to this project. You know, let me know where I can help. Uh, and, and he wrote me back and said, look, I'll be honest with you. We're not we're not going to do anything with this. You know, if you want to fork it and just go go to town, I'll link your repo in in our GitHub page. And, you know, I've had a he's like, I have had a couple other people interested in doing so but we don't want to manage this thing. And I was like, all right, fine. So at that point I was like, if I'm going to fork it, I, I want to, I don't want to like, if they're not associated with it, I don't feel it's genuine to call it dark market still. It, like, cause they had the dark branding they had dark wallet and then dark market. And I was like, okay, let's just do a clean slate. The idea is that this is a truly open marketplace, not just for illicit goods. You know, obviously dark implies it's a black market. We want it to be open to everyone. And so I recoined it open bazaar, forked it, and then they linked us in the original repo. And I think it's still there. If I believe, I believe if you go to their, their GitHub repo for dark market, it just links to us. And, uh, and then I went on Reddit and I put a post and I said, you know, I'm going to be forking this as if anybody wants to work on it with me, you know, come along. And I think the first comment was like, fuck you. Uh, <laughs> we don't, we don't, you know, you're a poser. And I was like, all right, great. I guess I'm not going to get any help, but slowly and surely I started getting more and more people contributing, uh, patches because they were going to the dark market repository and getting linked over to mine. And they just started following it and joining it. And, um, you know, there's actually, I mean, I, I'd have to go back and look at exactly all the people, but there's actually been some really great and and somewhat prominent developers that worked on it early on that contributed there's a couple people that went to blockstream and and stuff like that that were contributing really good ideas and washington was actually one of the best early uh, uh contributors not not from a code perspective but he would he had come with a bunch of already thought out ideas of how we could improve the marketplace i mean originally it was a very basic um you know escrow type marketplace idea but he brought along these ideas of like doing more contract based transactions that had state and could, you know, it was more involved and, 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 and several other like really interesting ideas about where we could take open bazaar that made it much more than just a simple hackathon. <laughs>